What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy Alex and today we're going to be checking out the Green Mile. Finally! Don't believe the lies to see. I can be more than a robot. Alright guys, so welcome back to the channel. If y'all have not hit that subscribe button. Subscribe, motherfucker. Go ahead and do that. Join the family. And guys, let's give a quick shout out to our patrons. Drop some comments down below right now. Literally pause the video. Drop a comment that says, the patrons here are badass because they keep giving us these slappers to react to, dude. The Green Mile is the movie that won the poll on the Patreon. If you guys want to be a part of that, link to the Patreon will be at the top of the description. And something that I found out about this movie, and it's the same fact that I didn't know about whenever we were checking out the Shawshank Redemption, is this is a Stephen King story. I had no idea. Damn, Stephen King made Shawshank Redemption. Or The Green Mile. So we're going to be checking out another one of those Stephen King stories directed by our boy Frank. And I am super ready, man. Long ass movie, so I'm not going to make y'all wait any longer. Longer, let's dive into it, baby. Come on now. Nah. Oh, I do have grapes. Grapes! Not many. Mm. It's the damn Warner Brothers intro, man. Every time you see that, every time, it is gonna be a fantastic movie. Oh, God. Is that how we're starting the movie right now? Got a damn cotton field and two white dudes with guns? Three? Four? Oh shit. Five? Six. Six dudes with guns. The hell do you need that many people? Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two. You need twenty-two dudes to do what? Pitchforks, guns, the green mile. Wow. That intro didn't give us too much to work with, but. Are, were you the one in that recollection threatening children, old man? Or were you the one being threatened? My dude's eyebrows won't quit. I've been moving this down. How am I looking, Paul? It's better. That's better. Damn, where is this? This is nice. Look at that spread. Doesn't matter how many liver spots, man. The heart wants what the heart wants. Just two pieces of dry toast tape to things. You know, we're not supposed to let you wander off. Mm. Yeah, dude could fall and break a hip. What do you do up in those hills? Just walk. That is a weird dynamic, though. Once people start getting a good bit older, it's like you almost have to start limiting their abilities, which is super weird because they're your elders. Such a strange dynamic to tell. I don't I don't like that. It's always been, dude, you dropped something. Oh, dude, he's snacking down on the cold toast. First, I thought he was like giving it to birds and shit. That's a long walk. Why do we always watch this stuff? It's interesting. Bunch of inbred trailer trash. <laughs> oh, shit. I just didn't sleep well, so I had a few bad dreams. It happens. Am I the only one out there that thinks that when people ask, like, hey, what's wrong? Or why are you having a bad day? It's like, that's what puts me in a bad mood. Sometimes I'm like, hey, I was on the verge, and then you just pushed me over. Thanks, asshole. I don't know, though. <laughs> Maybe I'm alone. <laughs> Jerry Springer to easy listening. This is more the vibe. Let's get this. I'm in heaven and the cares that hung around me through the wind. Oh God, why is he crying? I'm a mountain and to reach the... Why are they all looking at him? He wasn't crying that loud. Oh, that is good napping weather, man. Oh my God, dude, the nap I could take with it, with weather like that. I have to tell you that I was a prison guard during the depression. I supervised all the executions. Holy shit. No, you left that little detail out. Death row was called the last mile. We called ours the green mile. We had the electric chair. Oh. Oh, Sparky, we called it. He's got like a slight smile with that almost. Could be wrong, but. I had the worst urinary infection of my life. Oh, dude, okay. Thanks for that. It was also the year of John Coffey, the two dead girls. Literal black and white stripes, dude. Dude, that horn. You all right, man? But you had a kidney stone? Or a damn infection that makes it feel like razors? What'd I do? They bust the springs. Oh my God. 
giant man. Dead man! Dead man walking! Jesus, Dead please, man. what is he yelling about? Dead man! It's a, all right, buddy, we got it. What are you doing? We understand. We got a dead man walking here. Enormous, dude. It's enough. Yes, thank you. Jesus, shut up, Percy. Dude, my guy's arms are bigger than this dude's head. Can you talk? Yes, I suppose. I can talk. I already feel like he's really nice. He looks scared. Move your ass. You could, oh my God. The baton's not gonna do anything. I don't care where you go, Percy. He's just a moment's not here at this very moment. Percy, get your ass out of here. Napoleon complex little shit. Oh. <laughs> Percy, you got deep-rooted issues, buddy. Who hurt you? Gosh, it's like you can't treat people like that. Your name is John Coffey. Yes, sir, boss. Like to drink. Only not spelled the same. Do you leave the light on after bedtime? Because I get a little scared in the dark sometimes. Oh, dude. Wow. I forgot Tom Hanks' character's name, but you can tell that he's like, he's genuine. He's he's treating the prisoners like people. Fuck that Percy, dude. And j this John Coffey, dude, like I said, he looks scared already, man. You can tell he's just a kid that, that got very, very large. I couldn't help it, boss. I tried to take it back, but it was too late. What's he saying? Right now I want to hear about this new inmate. Aside from how big he is, okay? Monstrous big. <laughs> Imbecile man, he deserves to fry for what he done. Well, let's see if that's true or not. What? God's sake, what? Uh, the this girls! Is... The girls are gone! The way that this is shot and edited is really cool. As he's reading the letter, we're seeing what's happening in real time. Oh, so, okay, this is the beginning of the movie. Okay. Oh gosh. <laughs> what in the hell happened? Jesus. Oh my gosh. Is this like a Lenny from Love Mice and Men type of thing? Oh my god, do they look like dolls in his hands? I couldn't help it. I tried to take it back, but it was too late. Wow. This dude plays like a prison warden in every movie he's in or what? True, you ordered Poissy Wetmore off the block? It is. Like it or not. The wife of the governor of this state has only one nephew. His name happens to be Percy Whitmore. Of course it does. Of course it does. Percy couldn't get there by himself. Ah, oh, that's some bullshit, dude. The man is mean and careless and stupid. That's a bad combination in a place like this. I think he just wants to see one cook up close. What a fucking trash person. I think I have something to help you sleep. You can have all you want. Still got something wrong with my waterworks. Your wife's willing to fiddle your willis, buddy. Go to bed. Is the electric chair still a thing? I should know that, but I, I don't. I think there's still a select few states that use the electric chair. Yes, the legislature loosened up those price strings enough to hire on a new guy. <laughs> what? It ain't normal for a mouse to come upon people this way. Oh, the big mouse expert. <laughs> the mouse man. Mouse man. Mickey Mouse himself. Is Minnie Mouse your mama? Oh, brutal, no. We'll be hip deep in my swing. I here. just want to see what it'll do. She's going to take it back. <laughs> Damn, he's bolting. <laughs> Three officers to get the mouse. Three grown men. <laughs> How smart are they, mouse? Yep. <laughs> Aw, oh, Percy's gonna kill the mouse, isn't he? That's a goddamn mouse. <laughs> Brave little bastard. Gotta give him that. Everybody, every, everybody just gives him a little bit of food. It like just goes to show the character traits of Percy, right? All these other people's natural instincts like, oh, let's feed him. Let's see what he does. Percy's like, I'm gonna kill that boy with a stick. Okay. <laughs> You got terrible aim, Percy. I'm gonna rip your disease head off! Dude, Percy's literally got issues, man. How someone like that becomes a police officer, I don't know. I get, like you said, the connections, but Jesus Christ. His natural inclination is to kill it? Like, who kills animals? Damn serial killers, that's how they start out. You wanna think about what you were doing just now? I was trying to get the mouse. They also scared the living crap out of me and Bill. Not to mention the inmates. So what? Fuck you. Oh, don't. Yeah, you try it. Go on. 
It's always the people that are highly connected that are little shits. Or it's not always, not a definitive statement, but there's a correlation, that's for sure. Percy sucks. On your daughter and her family are here. All right, sitting down, sitting down, rehearsing now. Everybody settle. <laughs> praying, praying, Lord is my shepherd, and so forth and so on. Never do it again, that's for sure. <laughs> Still praying, still praying, getting right with Jesus. Do it quietly, you old gank. <laughs> you old gank. I don't believe they actually shake their dicks, Harry. Damn, could have been a party. Getting clamped, getting wired. Gosh, that is terrifying, man. Makes my stomach hurt a little bit, like it makes it turn a little bit. You have anything to say before your sentence is carried out? I don't want to shit in your hat. <laughs> okay. I got to have Mae West sit on my face because I'm one horny motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, this is just like a trial run? Oh, yeah. Is he putting that sponge on his head? Conducts electricity directly to the brain, fast like a bullet. Don't ever throw the switch on a man without that. Wow. Look at that, dude. Setting up chairs for people to watch. Under what circumstance? I know people that like were pained and if, if they, he killed one of their family members or something, they could be there. I don't know who else would want to see that. It'll be fine. You'll do fine. Oh my god, dude, this makes me so nervous. Oh. Oh my gosh, dude, my heart. Roll on, two. <laughs> that is awful. Oh. He's still alive. Oh my god! Oh my god, he's still fucking alive! Adios, chief. <gasps> Drop us a card from hell. Dude, he is such a little shit. Percy needs to be the one in the psych ward. What's up his ass? You. You gotta hate new boy? That the way it is around here? No, we just hate the pieces of shit. Why don't you just move on? Take that job at Rye Ridge. I might just take it too, as soon as you put me out front. Why? Why do you want to do that so willingly? And if I say no? I might just stick around for good. <sighs> what are you laughing about? He's got cheese on his balls and mouth is just- You're not gonna believe this. <laughs> Look. <laughs> what? That's- Mr. Maud, Mr. Jingles. Mr. Jingles? That is name he was put in my ear. <laughs> no way? Dude, there's no way. What in the hell kind of damn wizard mouse did you find? Like he a circus mouse. Yeah, seriously. <laughs> we ought to find a cigar box, get some cotton batting from the dispensary to line it with. That should do real nice. That was out of character. Who did Percy just have sex with to put him in a good mood? Or what do you want, Percy? Close the door. It's a tumor ball. Oh, I knew it was a coming. Tumor. I knew it was coming. It's the size of a lemon, they said. I haven't told her. I can't think how. How do you even do that? She's going to die. Oh my god, dude, that's... She's gonna hug his wife, hold her a little bit tighter. <sighs> okay, now I'm freaking out about that. I thought it was funny at the beginning, but... I have a feeling he's gonna piss blood. They don't have a bathroom in the house? <sighs> I have no idea what that means. Oh, oh god. What is the cause of that? Billy the Kid, there it is. Here's the crazy ass inmate. I'm gonna get crucified for saying this, but who's Billy the Kid? Boy is dope to the gills. That dude didn't look doped out, he didn't look drugged up. It looks like he's gone through one phase of an execution that didn't work. That's what it looks like. Part of me now thinks Percy, if he gets the front of this, he's like not gonna be satisfied with it. And he's gonna be like, I want John Coffee. That's what I think is gonna happen. Careful. Oh! Oh my gosh, dude, it is a Hellraiser! Okay! Hit it, Percy! God damn it! Come on! You warned me! You warned me! Well, come on! Percy, why couldn't you do anything? You just stood there like a ghost? Didn't even have the courage to do anything. Just froze like a little bitch. Oh, God! Did not expect that. Boss, I need to see you down here. 
Oh, jeez. This is not a good time, John Coffey. Not a good time at all. Mouth on the floor? It's that sensation, dude, when it, like, people are afraid to touch, like, a toilet seat, but whenever you're throwing up, it's like your mouth is all on it, just laying on it as a pillow. Care zero percent so whenever people are in pain it's super interesting to see like the kind of weird stuff that they'll do just to get themselves comfortable while they're in that pain Close. Well, you know you ain't supposed to do that just to help <laughs> oh my gosh holy shit what is he doing is john coffee's hand on his dick what is happening <laughs> What? He's dreaming. I just took it back so off and tied my boss. What? What in the fucking stranger things is happening? Use his power and becomes tired like L? Dude, did he literally reverse whatever health effect Tom Hanks' character was seeing? He just grabs his dick and makes it better? I am confused as hell. <laughs> He's gonna pee completely normal. <laughs> John Coffey have magic hands? What did the doctor say? No pain down there, dude. My boy's ready to go. <laughs> hey, let's do tonight. Oh, I want you to stew in this. Feels great. Okay. A little caress to the face. Okay. Progression is happening. Half chub engaged. Okay. Still to the morning? You dog! What the hell is happening? We haven't gone four times in one night since we were 19. Now tell me what's going on. Four times in one night? I'm thinking of taking the morning off set. What are you guys gonna do all day? Smelling me some cornbread. It's from my missus. She wanted to thank you. <laughs> yeah, she did, because she benefited greatly from what you did. Was your missus, please? <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Several times. <laughs> Can I get Dale, Mr. Jacobson? His first thing to do is to give some away. What about me? Don't you hold that on me. You Ew, dude. Dummy, nigger. <laughs> give the guy a toothbrush because he's got the job. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Beak. Nasty human. <laughs> yeah. What is your issue, nasty ass? I'm currently cooking up some turds. Okay. Piss on me. Oh, the damn fire hose? Oh my gosh. Hey! Hey! I mean, what are you gonna do? That's what you get, dude. No one wants to put up with your dumb ass. I'll, I'll learn my lesson. I'll be good. Ew, his teeth, bro. I can't handle that. It's disgusting, man. Hey, dude. You be a nickel for that moon pie. Okay. Boy enjoyed it 0%. Stuffed the whole thing in. He's gonna spit it all over him, isn't he? Oh! I'm ready to go! Where are we going? Dude, what the hell? Moon pie thing was pretty original, gotta give him that. That is so disgusting, dude. Ew, man. Literally the definition of insanity right there. Maybe he's not expecting different results. Maybe he doesn't give a fuck about the results. Yeah, I'll grab a few things. It's a big day for you and Mr. Jingles. Important folks heard about your mouths. Wanna see him perform? All right, rehearsing now. Oh my God, it was just a trick to get him in there? Isn't that something? You done good, old timer. Come on now, I was just having- <laughs> Okay. Fuck your asshole. Oh. Your sister's pussy, I think. Okay. Okay. <laughs> oh shit, he's pissing everywhere. You talk about this to anyone, <laughs> get you all fired. Such a piece of shit, dude. How could a boy be trusted, Mrs. Jenkins? We forget to feed him. <laughs> oh, we gotta get rid of the mouse? How about mouse veal? Mouse veal? Tours are acting down in Florida. Oh, they're just kind of telling him things to get him to go along with it. Oh, there you go. Oh god, he's- OH GOD! Seriously? Percy, what the fuck, dude? Oh! Seriously, dude, this guy's on death row. He lost everything in his life and you gotta take away the only little tiny bit of happiness that he has. It's fucked up, man. Give him to me. Give him to me, might still be time. Oh my god, no way. Help him. I mean, we got witnesses here this time, right? No way. Who is this guy? 
Oh my god. That happens every time he uses that? What are those? Maybe if he was trying to bring two girls back, it was it took too much power or something. I'm not sure. Oh my god, dude. No way. Oh my god. What did that you is do? Unreal. I hit Dale's mouse. Boss pissed bad. He me. Oh god, dude. I had no idea the movie was gonna be like this. That's the face that I'm making. I don't know what the hell's going on. My house is fine. Yeah, you expect me to believe that? I heard the goddamn thing crunch. Aren't you glad Mr. Jingles is okay? After all those talks we had about keeping the prisoners calm. How about we strike your ego a little bit and not stroke it? Strike it down. Egotistical, narcissistic, psychopath man. It is who the hell you think you are. Huh? Ah! 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 I put you up front for Dale. You put in your transfer to Briar Ridge the very next day. How about that, Percy? That's the deal. All right. I don't think it's going to be. I think Percy's going to get what he wants and still stick around like a little bitch. I need to stop cursing so much. I apologize. He's a bitch. <laughs> Looks like the damn Beast's Castle in Beauty and the Beast. Wow. Aw. I'm kind of sad Dale's going to be leaving. What did he do? Yeah. He'd get good. <laughs> That's sad. I can't have a mouse on my shoulder while wow. you know. I'll take him, boss, just for now. If Dale don't mind. Yeah, you take him, John. John didn't do it. I already know that. I sure wish I could have met you guys some ways out. What do you guys, what's your take on it? If you can make somebody happy like that, even though it's not true, is that making him happy? <laughs> oh, God. That is so sad. That mouse looked so fucking cute in that video right there. That clip. Scene. Whatever. Okay, glad she's made peace with that. Yeah, it's all right. Oh, he doesn't want damn Percy to do it. He's just ready to shoot him? Why is that in your hand prepared already? I wonder if that's standard protocol or not. Or if Percy's just doing Percy shit. I want to make a prediction. Something tells me that his heart's still going to be beating after the first one and then Percy's going to pull the gun and shoot him. You have anything to say before sentence is carried out? I'm sorry for what I do. Don't forget about my mouthfeel. Oh, God, that's sad. There's no such place. That's just a fairy tale these guys told you to keep you quiet. Just thought you should know. Faggot. What in the fuck are you doing? Dude, are you kidding me? That's the last thing he's gonna hear? Oh my God, he's not gonna do it. He's not gonna fucking put the water. Oh my God, he's not gonna do it. That is so sadistic. How can you, how can you actually be like that? I think there's a good argument for torture right there. You should be prosecuted. I want to punch you in the face. Double check, double check. There's no water leading up to it. There's no water dripping. Roll on two. Oh no, he knew, he knew. I did Don't you stop it. It's too late for that. Dude, will you shut the fuck up? Oh, he feels it. Holy shit. They're all saying, fuck this place. What, you son of a bitch? It's all under control. It doesn't Everybody seem under stay control. Calm. I cannot believe that. Oh. Dude, Percy, you sick fuck. If you can't even watch, what are you doing? Just what are you away. doing? Oh, my ass, Percy. Ah! Thank you. Oh, damn. You okay? I can feel it from here. Why? Where's Mr. Jam? Don't think he'd be back. He felt it too. Through me. Awful time now, boss. Dog time. I'm confused as to what John did that time. He's tired because he used his resources, for lack of a better word, but what did he do? Felt the ability to feel Dell? Oh my gosh, this movie, dude. Oh, it's so grand. Is she uh, the, the grown-up girl in Jumanji with Robin Williams? That's who she looks like. I love you, I 
She's having one of her good days. Thank God for that. What's a bad day? She's not herself anymore. She swears. She doesn't even know she's doing it. Wow. Is she suffering from dementia or something like that? Oh, she has the tumor. Duh. No shit. I'm glad for you and Jan. Wow. Not even necessarily glad for her. It's like she's not there anymore. It's such a weird feeling too because people can transform whenever they have sicknesses. They're still that person that you know and you love, but it's like they embody a different person. Y'all saw what he did to the mouth. Elephant in the room. I could have gone the rest of the day without you bringing that up. He took my bladder infection away. Oh, it was a bladder infection? Damn, that was brutal. It's true. He came home that day, he was... Ready. All better. <laughs> you're thinking about Melinda. Yeah. So you're talking about taking John Coffey to her. Oh my gosh, can you imagine? And let's not forget, John Coffey is a murderer. I don't think he did it at all. And plus, he's... Huge. <laughs> he tried to get away. Nothing anybody could do to stop him. Tell us what you have in mind. What is that? Crushing up pills? What am I seeing? Come on, boss. I've been good. I've been good all day. Oh God. They're gonna drug him? What drug is that? <clears throat> Oh, they're gonna knock him out so that they can take... Uh, I see. I see what's happening. Let's knock this fucking boy out, bring coffee to the lady's house, have him heal her. What are you gonna do about Percy? What is this? Payback. Are they gonna put him in the damn solitary room? Can't make me. Oh, you did wrong about that, you know. Ah! I'm not saying anything. I'm gonna look the other way. We can. Mm -hmm. and we are. Damn! That's super fucked up, but at this point, Percy's done so much messed up shit himself that I don't even care. <laughs> oh gosh. I mean, that's what they gotta do to complete the plan, right? Oh my gosh. We go for the ride now. Hell yeah, we're going for the ride now. Let's go. <laughs> Dude, what is happening? Why are you not knocked Man. out? Man. That's right, nigger. Bait as you want. What's wrong? What's wrong? He's seeing all the bad stuff that this guy did. <laughs> Is that right? Oh, I'm spinning. Like on shitty ass drug. Have me some shine or. Have <laughs> me some shine? Go back to bed, dude. Players all the hell down, electric tech. Incoherent, senseless. It's just despicable, dude. Disgusting. Yeah, bad. Man. Yeah, he is. Dude, this is such a cool story. You never see a story like this. Oh my gosh, the nerves are absolutely unreal right now. I'd be so scared if I were one of those guys. That, Like he said, man, that's your job. That's even risking jail time. That is scary stuff. Gosh, that must be such a good feeling. The things you take for granted, the smell of plants. He's so happy. You know where we're taking you tonight? Hit the lady? That's right. But how do you know? Don't know. Tell the truth, boss. I don't know much of anything. I never have. Wow. Like, uh, whenever I was watching The Conjuring, it's like, the dolls are a conduit for the spirits. It makes me feel like coffee's a conduit, or, you know, the middleman between God and the earth. It's like God speaks and goes through John. Super interesting. Boss, look. Someone's up. This is a mistake. Oh, God, is it? It's the guy, isn't it? The man's as big as the truck. John Coffee. Oh, my God. What is he gonna do? Help. Oh no! I'm warning you! No, Wait, how? Listen, no, hold no, right there, I shoot! No! Oh gosh. How can you expect him to just trust you like that? I mean, he needs to, but. Ow! Oh. What do you want? Just to help, boss. That's all. No one can. Oh my god. You stop now. You hear me? Paul, I don't want him up there. Can you imagine? He's a convicted murderer going up the stairs to where you're- I would be freaking the fuck out. I would demand an explanation, but I mean, I'm glad that he didn't put up too much of a fight. You gotta at least let her know what's going on. Just watch. Just watch. Giant coffee man. Like to drink. Only not spelled the same. Like the- I love that line. John coffee man like the drink, only not spelled the same. Wow. I feel like he's gonna get upset. I feel like the dude's gonna get upset. Maybe not. He takes all of that? Oh my gosh, wow. I'll be fine. Just let me be. How did I get here? Oh my God, I can't believe that. We were going to the hospital. Did I have the x-ray? You did. It was all- It was clear. There was no tumor. <laughs> What's your name? John 
coffee, ma'am. Like the drink, only not spilt the same. I dreamed you were wandering in the dark, and so was I. We found each other in the dark. Take it, John, it's a present. St. Christopher, I want you to have it, Mr. Coffee, and wear it. He'll keep you safe. Gosh, dude, are you kidding me? <sighs> John Coffey's character is the epitome of an empath. Like, totally, totally understands empathy. He, he doesn't even understand it. He is empathy, right? Oh my gosh. Oh, come on now, you gotta stay on your feet. <laughs> oh god, I feel like Percy's gonna be out of there. For some reason, I think Percy's gonna be out. I know John's gonna have to die, right? I just don't want him to. <laughs> Yeah! Percy, you nonsensical man. Right now, I want out now! The dude doesn't learn anything! I'll tell people how you sabotage Dale's execution. Sabotage how you pissed yourself. <laughs> Fuck you, buddy. We know people too. Tom Hanks with a firm hand. I like it. Such a little bitch. Crying and peeing all over the place and acting like you're tough, little boy ass man. <laughs> Oh my god! Oh my god! Is he gonna... Is he gonna transfer the damn tumor to him? Okay... Percy goes through a lot of shit, but I mean, he brings it on himself. Boy, what you looking at? You wanna kiss my ass? You wanna suck my dick? Okay, what is going on? What in the fuck? John used one ba bad man to kill another bad man? Two birds, one stone type of deal. I don't know what I'm seeing. I had no idea the movie was gonna be like this. I punished them bad men. I punished them both. Why Wild Bill? He's a bad man. I saw what Wild Billy done. Take my hand, boss. Oh shit, he's gonna be able to see it now. You see for yourself. Oh, no. <laughs> I got to give you a little bit of myself. What? Was it? Wait, was it Wild Bill that killed the two girls? No. Wow, the way this was filmed, super dreamlike. Very, very good job. Oh my God, he's gonna kill the girls. Oh shit, the painter. Oh my God. No, I don't want to watch that, dude. I do not want to watch that. You disgusting fuck. He's got that smirk on his face, too. Oh my god. I love you, sister. You make me the noise. Do what happens. Those were the whispers from the beginning, dude. Percy Wetmore. Son. Does this have anything to do with what happened in my house? No. <laughs> Boys. Nope. The hell? Oh my gosh, the full circle is him in the damn <laughs> I'm not about to say I'm happy anybody goes to a destination like that. I will not say that. He's in the mental hospital. Uh, all I'm gonna say is it makes sense, okay? It makes sense. Does hell know that coffee's innocent, I mean? It's a good question. If it can't help, don't tell him. Wow. I mean, that's like whenever you really care about someone, right? You give them... <sighs> Don't even let him know, because you know it's going to hurt him. Low boss. I don't want John to die. I don't want that. Oh, Sit God, down. dude, pierce my heart. When I stand before God, and he asks me why did I kill one of his true miracles, what am I going to say? Wow. You tell God the Father it was a kindness you done. It must be something that you want. It's like they're like begging, can we do anything for you, man? What do we do? Just tell us. I ain't never... See me a flick of show. Oh. Oh, God. That, that's why he can't hear it. It all makes sense. This is such a good movie. Oh, my gosh. These angels, just like a man. He knows what it's like in heaven? Oh, no. Oh, no, dude. I don't want this. What's the saying? If you love something, you let it go? No, dude. Be all He's comforting them, dude. I'll give it back after. These people are sitting there watching, gonna watch him die, thinking they're getting justice, and it was that scum fuck painter that they hired. There's lots of folks here 
hate me. Feel how we feel, Dad. But we don't hate you. Go on, kill that raping baby killer. No, twice. it's not what he That'd did. Oh, God. Mm. I'm sorry for what I am. Oh, God, dude. Please, Bo, don't put me in the dark. I was afraid of the dark. It's literally just, oh my gosh, I feel it in my stomach, dude. Mm. Oh, Jesus, that is so sad. So weird, just the concept of like your soul leaving your body. So, so bizarre. It was the last execution I ever took part in. Mm. Do you feel up to taking a walk? Oh gosh, now we're gonna see what's see what's in this. I completely forgot about this. Oh gosh. And guys, help me out. Who is she that he's like trusting her with all this information? What is it? Hey, wake up, old fella. He's got a mouse. Oh, it isn't. Can't be. Wait, what? That's Mr. Jingles? Oh my god. No. How long do mice live? Go on. So many things that this movie have just eaten me up inside. Uh, Whatever magic was inside of him just slipped into my wow. tiny friend here. As for me, John had to give me a part of himself. He infected you. Lie? Wow. I'm 108 years old, Elaine. Oh, shit! I've had to see my friends and loved ones die off through the years. Oh, oh. And my curse is knowing that I'll be there to see it. It's my punishment. What? For what? For killing a miracle of God. Uh, is that right? That's what he said he wanted. Mr. Jingles? Mr. Jingles. At the beginning of this movie, I did not think I was going to get choked up by a mouse named Mr. Jingles. Wow. Dude, that transition shot was nuts. If he could make a mouse live so long. Right, 64 years. How much longer do I have? Oh. Sometimes the green mile are, they, are we gonna so long. He's gonna die. Okay, wow, that would have been a morbid ending. Wow. What the fuck, dude? Dude, oh my god. I, I probably said that 9,000 times during this reaction, but it's... The film was unbelievable to the point where I don't even have words. It feels like the words that I try to make, that I try to get out to actually have some form, so, blah, blah, blah. I, I'm telling you, I can't talk. The words that I would try to get out to have some form of meaning wouldn't actually do anybody justice in this film. The movie is filled with symbolism, right? I, I really think that John Coffey was like this Christ-like figure, right? This Christ-like martyr that God sent his son to earth to die. Um, it seemed like John embodied a lot of that upper echelon type power, that overarching power, that light that comes with godly, godlike figures. Um, so kind of John Coffey's Jesus, you have Wild Bill or Bill, Bill Nye, the wild man. He represents this, the devil, Satan, right? So that's kind of what I, I've gotten from this. And those are the main characters. Obviously, you know, Tom Hanks character was just the, the protagonist of the story. But then one of the main characters was Mr. Jingles. I'm thinking, I'm like, there's so much symbolism here. What is the symbolism of Mr. Jingles? Is it that he was some type of guardian angel? That he he was just a, a form of innocence, like an embodiment of innocence, and you can do with that good or bad, which was shown many different ways in the film with people's feelings towards Mr. Jingles? Is it just a little glimmer of hope and happiness that has gotten into the Green Mile? I, I don't know. Um, the meaning of this is going to be different for me for me than it is for you guys and it's probably going to be different um, as I think about this movie a little bit more but right now fresh coming off the film it makes me think that everybody's green mile is it's the green mile is symbolic for the walk of life right we are all walking down that path to our death death is the only thing that's certain and, and the road to get there can be riddled with happiness or darkness and destruction and it's um it's really eye-opening like I said, I'm kind of on sensory overload mode right now, so I kind of want to put the ball in y'all's court and ask you guys to drop some comments to let me know what you think the meaning of this film is, but 
All in all, such a well done movie, man. No wonder you guys wanted me to see this after watching Shawshank Redemption. It's another, it, you put it in that bucket of just upper echelon type movies. They don't make movies like this anymore. <sighs> Patrons, y'all did an awesome job voting this one in and I wanna say thank you guys so much. If you guys want access to the full length movie reactions or to vote in the polls for the next film that we check out together, link to the Patreon will be in the top of the description. And with that, you beautiful people, I will see y'all tomorrow. I love you guys, don't forget that. Peace!